Hi everybody, friends. Blessed third Sunday of Advent. So this is a Sunday where we invite you to wear your uh, beautiful Christmas sweaters as to share the joy of uh, Jesus' coming. This is the season, uh, this is a Sunday we call Gaudete Sunday, the Sunday of rejoicing. We'll be uh, using uh, uh, rose vestments. It's not pink, it's rose because Jesus rose from the dead. He didn't pink from the dead. That's why it's rose, although it's all the same quite frankly. Uh, nevertheless, we, we come to celebrate because Jesus is close. And the chapter, uh, the scripture that we reflect on this weekend is taken from the third chapter of Luke. And this is the, 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 the prophecy, the ministry of John the Baptist we are hearing about. And we are hearing unbelievable impact of his ministry. As John proclaims, people's lives are changed. They are generous, right? They are, they are sharing with the poor. They are giving of themselves. They are making... Uh, changes in their own lives, uh, repairing relationships, uh, turning from evil into good. Uh, because of the power of ministry of John the Baptist, they change their lives. They are truly preparing their lives for the coming of the Messiah. Well, just the same way John speaks to us, he calls us to conversion of hearts, right? And he calls us because, not because we are bad or because what we do is bad, but because he wants us to come closer to God, right? He wants our hearts to be renewed, to be strengthened. And so my invitation to you is simple. What is it in your life that needs conversion? What is it in your life that needs uh, of welcoming, of the joy of encounter with Jesus that will change something, that perhaps will help you to heal relationships in your family or friends, or that will make you even more generous toward the poor and the others, that will help you uh, to bridge uh, the gaps um, and, uh, in your own life and see how the, the work of God, how the presence of God really makes everything better, how it moves you forward. You know, God is at work in your life as he was at, li at work in the life of John the Baptist and everybody who listened to him. And as we listen to John's uh, proclamation this Sunday, uh, that proclamation also has power to change our lives because the Spirit of God is among us, because he's at work in us. And so I invite you uh, to join us this weekend, to celebrate with us this weekend, and um, to wear your crazy Christmas sweater this weekend as we want to uh, all join in celebration of Jesus' coming. God bless you.